Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. In NumberPy, the sum function is used to calculate the sum of array elements over a specified axis. Understanding how to use the axis parameter is crucial for effectively manipulating multidimensional arrays. Hashtag 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 what is an axis? In a number pi array, axis 0 refers to the rows, the vertical direction. Axis 1 refers to the columns, the horizontal direction. When you sum along an axis, you reduce the dimensionality of the array. Hashtag 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 syntax A. Input array Axis, axis or axis along which a sum is performed By default, it sums all elements Type, the type of the returned array and of the accumulator Out, alternative output array in which to place the result Keep dims, if set to true the reduced axis will be included in the result as dimensions with size 1. Initial, value to start the summation. Where, this condition is used to select elements to include in the sum. Hashtag 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 example code. Let's go through an example to illustrate how to use numpy.sum with different axes. Hashtag 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 step 1, import number pi. First, you need to import number pi. Hashtag 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 step 2, create a 2D number pi array. Let's create a 2D array, matrix. Hashtag 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 step 3, sum along axis 0. When you sum along axis 0, you sum the elements column wise. Hashtag 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 step 4, Sum along axis 1. When you sum along axis 1, you sum the elements row wise. Hashtag 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 step 5, keep dimensions. If you want to keep the dimensions of the original array, you can set keep dims equals true. Hashtag 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 step 6, summing all elements. If you don't specify an axis, np.sum will sum all elements in the array. Hashtag 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 summary. In this tutorial, you learned how to use numpy.sum to calculate the sum of a number pi array across different axes. Remember, use axis equals 0 to some columns. Use axis equals 1 to some rows. Use keep dims equals true if you want to maintain the original number of dimensions. This functionality is very useful for data analysis, especially when working with multidimensional data sets.